This one's, you know... We're about a year away, or maybe a year or two from seeing, uh, starting to see the American, American Pharaoh spawn. Exactly. So, so maybe we'll see. <clears throat> I, be interesting. I'm going, I went back to the 2014 drafts. That yeah, start is, there. Yeah, I'm interested. Go ahead. I think, so number one overall pick in 2014 was Andrew Wiggins. That's Ooh, right. Yeah. To the Andrew Cleveland Wiggins. Cavaliers. Where is he? He's, uh, he's in Timberwolves. He's so they traded that day, right? Wasn't for, it the, Kevin, for Kevin Love. Oh, yeah, that's so, right. So, so Andrew Wiggins was number one. Is Andrew Wiggins a good NBA player? He's been. He's okay. been he's been a solid a NBA player. 20. He's never taken the not, s- not this year. Is, he's is, been a good he's, he's been a good player. Yes. Is he worthy of a number one overall pick no. if the draft was today? No. 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 no, no, no. no. Uh, definitely no. not. Yeah, but he's know. had a successful f- f- successful career and, and he's been effective. He um, was a w- one and done Kansas guy. All right. Yep. N- next pick, Jabari Parker, Milwaukee oh. Bucks. He's been a total injured, he's been injured. injured one and done Duke guy. Injured Duke guy. Number three, Joel Embiid. Yes, he's been a. He's. I thought he would have been a bust. One and done, Kansas guy. Kansas guy. Number four. Oh boy, Aaron Gordon. Oh boy. Okay. Um, it's a crap so, oh, wow. one and done, Arizona yeah, guy, Orlando Magic. On Orlando. Number five from Australia, Dante Don, Exum. Yeah. U- Utah Jazz. He's, oh, a, he's a nice little bench player. Yeah, he's a, he's a, he's bench player, player, fifth overall pick. Yeah, yeah he's. Yeah. I mean, he's. A ba- I mean, that's the truth, though. He's a backup point guard kind of guy. He's a that's what he fifth is. Fifth overall pick. Yeah. That's why I'm saying the draft is NBA draft. You can't get excited for it nowadays. Number six, Marcus Smart. Turned out to be a very, very good player. So a six pick for the Celtics. I mean, this guy is. I mean, this is. You know who he reminds me a of now. He's the a, more I, the more I watch him, he reminds me of what Tony Allen used. To, just that that bench defensive guy yeah, come off the I bench agree. and just but hound Tony people. Tony Allen started for most of his career. He did. He did. Yeah. But but you know what I mean. You know what I'm talking about, right? He's gonna take out the number one wing player and he's gonna be aggressive, do the dirty play. Oh my God, he's so just Marcus got that. Smart had one more year of college, Oklahoma State soccer. More. Also into the Celtics who have a good coach who yes. knows what he's doing. Very good coach. Number seven overall, Julius Randle. Yeah, what a what a well, uh, LA Lakers total bust. one and done Kentucky guy. What what a total Freshman. bust he's turned out to be so far. Like, he's he's, he's he has can't, say again? Can't, can't go to his right. Say again? Can't go to his right. He's like Zoolander. Can't oh, go, can't to, go his to his right. right. Yeah, no, it's true, no. though. He has no right, no. Th- this, no right. this draft, the top ten, the first guy was Canada from Wiggins. Number three, Embiid, Cameroon. Number five, Dante Exum, Australia. And now at number eight, another Canadian, Nick Stauskas. Stauskas. Oh, wow. uh, wasn't he at Oklahoma City Thunder? Sacramento. Uh, he was drafted by Sacramento. Oh, okay. Sophomore out of Michigan, so another second-year player. He's number eight, if you don't even know who he is. Number nine... Noah Vonie, V O N E I E I E H, a junior out of Louisiana Lafayette. Number 10. Is McBuckets. Effid Payton. McBuckets. Oh, wait, no, the next one's McBuckets. Yeah, Effid Payton, a junior out of. Okay, so, oh, no, Noah Vonier was from Indiana, a one and done freshman. Then Effid Payton was a junior from Louisiana Lafayette. Yeah. Number 11, Doug McDermott, the only senior to go. It turned out to be an okay player but here and there. But 11 overall. Yeah, it was 11 overall. So yeah. now we're out of the top 10. Let's let's move yeah. to, two, so let's 2015. to the 2015. next draft. Yeah, so that's. So right there, I think, proves the point of. Um, a total crap. Shoot. And it's funny because then they have notable undrafted. And players. none of those guys have turned into superstars. No. 2014, you don't have a single superstar. I mean, Embiid is the closest I mean, um, Embiid would probably go number one. He's not a redraft. superstar, though. He's a star. He, he's turned into a pretty good player. He's going to be a superstar. What about you think he'll wind up a superstar? Um, I don't know. Next year he's going to be a superstar. Uh, he might not. Next year he's going to be he's gonna be a star in, like, starting in whatever. Like, you see how they do <clears> now? He's going to be a starting center for whatever team he goes to. Yeah. yeah. All right. Because you got who you got cousins and then who else? Yeah, geez, you know cousins. <clears throat> you- I was going to ask you, gentlemen, um, with the whole Antonio Brown situation, him not getting paid what he's specifically supposed to be asking for. Is it true that a, an actual NBA team can stop finding? I'm sorry, uh, NFL, NFL team, team can stop finding a player. If they don't show up to OTAs, like yes, after a while, yes, they can. But but those fines don't matter because these guys are holding out because they they know they're going to get huge they contracts. Have a way of washing them away. Yeah, they they just wash it they, away. They That's do part of publicly that always we yeah. this and then they make a way of paying it. Yeah, they, they they don't they don't actually think, find them. It sounds it sounds so it's like a chess game basically. Yeah, it's all a chess game, right? And and good for Zach Martin, by the way, getting that big time contract, uh, forty million guaranteed. You guys saw this? Mm-hmm. Yeah, awesome, awesome. Yeah. I mean, highest paid guard in history. 
Good for him. Now, the 2015 draft, number one, I remember driving here, what, Carl Anthony Towns, Dominican Republic. Absolute but superstar, future Hall of Famer. One and done some freshman point. from Kentucky. So he was a no debt pro brainer. But again, there's only number one. <laughs> D'Angelo Russell. Snitch. We're supposed to be a really, really good point guard. He has no, 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 regressed. No, 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 give D'Angelo Russell some time. He's also been. Interested. He's regressed. Well, the thing is, these guys were all freshmen, all one and done. <laughs> but I get it. But yeah. I mean, no, I say, Russell's a bust yet. Like, just, I didn't say bust. I, I just said that he's regressed. Number two overall. <laughs> he got put on Brooklyn. <laughs> number three, number three, Jaleel yeah. Okafor. Oof, yeah, one I, I think Duke. we can call him a bust now. Then Porzingis at four. Phil, thank you, Phil Jackson. Wait, no, that's not a bust. <laughs> then Mario you know? Hizonia. Uh, Croatia, Orlando Magic. He's probably back there. Yeah. Back then there. Willie Cauley Stein. <laughs> because He's Kentucky had two players there. with high fantasy names. They had Carl Anthony Towns and they had uh, Willie Cauley Stein. Ooh. Ooh. Cauley Stein's a good six shooter, overall, man. Overall, six overall. Then seven, Emmanuel Mouye. Well, we could say that's a bust. Yeah. Well, he's back. He's on the next Yeah, next Emmanuel Mouye's been a bust. Then he's number eight, I, and I don't know why you would draft a guy with this name because it sounds like he's going to be a bust. Stanley Johnson. <laughs> Stanley Johnson should we do my taxes. Is that- oh, the, the kid from um, Stanley Johnson played for the Detroit. Pace. Oh, it was Detroit? Oh, yeah. excuse me. Number oh, isn't, nine. That, isn't that the guy that Harden dropped this year? No, that's Wesley Johnson. Sorry, that's Wesley. Number nine, Frank Kaminsky. Good. Yeah, he he's good, but he never, he yeah. was a really. Four-year player. Wisconsin. Four-year player for, uh, was he was Nova, right? The Wisconsin. Oh, he was. Excuse me, he was Wisconsin. That's right. They went to the championship. They went to the championship that year. And then lost the, to Nova. Then the tenth pick was Justice Winslow. Yeah, he played another for, Duke he played freshman. Somebody. That's who everybody wanted the Knicks to get instead of Porzingis. Right? Yeah, we see how that turns out. Yeah, I mean, so you're, I don't know. Where, I think he's. I think he's selling top, peanuts somewhere. That's the top <laughs> ten. So again, I mean, Carl Anthony Towns one overall, but a one overall pick should be a no brainer. Porzingis. Then Porzingis at four. Mm-hmm. I mean, everyone else is. At least Winslow starts. Yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's a it's a crapshoot. I mean, but but this but you know what what really proves that this whole thing's a crapshoot, right? Is that's... that Isaiah Thomas was drafted sixtieth over. Overall, uh, a few years ago, so it's a total crapshoot. You can get somebody anywhere. Well, now it we just has to, to be the right guy, right situation, again, right time. I'm going to go to 2016. So, number one overall, sh- who just was cheating with Kendall, one of the Jenner girls, Kylie or Kendall, uh, Ben Simmons. Good for him. Uh, number one Good overall, job, ben. right? Yeah. Number two, Brandon Ingram. Yeah, he worked out. Well, he's working on it. Number <laughs> three, Jalen Brown. They all work. Ooh, yeah, the, so far so good on all number these guys. Four, I don't know who this fourth one Number is. four, Dragon Bender. His name is Dragon? Yeah. It's Dragon Bender. Oh, it's a Croatian not name. Like, I used to play basketball. Not like Jonathan Bender? Number five, Chris Dunn. She's all right. She's cute. Uh, number six, because it's, K-R- it's K-R-I-S, and I went to grammar school with a Christine Dunn. Good for number you. Number six uh, number is uh, Buddy Heald. Which Buddy Heald, yeah. Uh, Oklahoma. Wow. He plays on... Um, He's on the Kings now. He was Buddy Basketball. He changed yeah. the boogie. That's right. That's right. Number but, seven. Buddy my- healed my, uh, my my arthritis. <laughs> <laughs> number seven. <laughs> number seven. <laughs> the power of illness. Number seven, <laughs> Jamal Murray. Jamal Murray. Let's take the name Jamal and mix it with Murray for no good he reason. He went to the Nuggets. He's pretty good. He's all right. Yeah. That's all right. That's not number bad. eight is Marquise Chris. Number nine is Jacob Potil, 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 I don't know Austrian that is. player. It's an Austrian yeah, player. Number me. ten is Thon Maker. Thon right. Maker, which yeah. would be great if the middle initial was J, because then it could be Thon Maker. Thon Maker. <laughs> I was, was going to ask you guys a question. Hit, hit it. Um, since Dwayne Casey got the Detroit Pistons yeah. job, does that mean Jason Kidd is out of a job? Basically, in the NBA, he's just tarnished like a Mark Jackson type of thing. Yeah, kinda. I mean, I don't see Jason Kidd getting another job anytime uh, soon. Uh, uh, no, Jason Kidd and Mark Jackson might be going to Cleveland. J- Jason what, together? Here's the thing, though. Jason Kidd is, 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 has fell victim to, it's not what you know, it's who you know. Jason. And so when you get finally get caught about Jason, that, that and then you can't find J- a job that, anymore. No, 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 no. Jason Kidd is a giant ass. And, you think so? Oh, yeah. Not, <laughs> he's a terrible yeah. guy. No, he's no, he's a, Jason Kidd is cool. He's a bad, bad guy. Bad guy. And so so when you, uh, I mean, I've known him since he was a teenager. I mean, like known him, known him. Like why he was, he went to with my friends in college. But yeah, he was a bad guy. And um, 
drunk, you'd get. I mean, just as drunk stuff out of the Hamptons and with the yeah, wife broke his and, son's uh, tailbone. and the Milwaukee thing. He's just a bad guy. But but Mark Jackson is to the point of a irre- he's irrelevant now because Steve Kerr replaces him, and we can all talk about how they had the same players, whatever. But now Steve Kerr has won how many championships? Three. And Mark Jackson is there. It's I, I, I texted it last week. It's like watch like it would be if Buck Showalter had to announce all of Joe Torrey's World Series. Wins. Right. I mean Steve that's. But sometimes you just yeah. need a coach like that who can get you right. there. So now you've got so so Mark Jackson has to do something to make himself relevant because <clears throat> even in that booth he's not the best broadcaster. Van Gundy is. No, I agree. So Jackson's got to go and be a winning coach somewhere and just. <laughs> I think LeBron, like, oh, I think Cle- he has to go to Cleveland. I think it's, yeah, yes. I don't think Cleveland's the answer. LeBron's not going to be there. You don't know that. You don't know. I do know that. He's not staying in Cleveland. No. He hates Stan Gilbert. Now, the other difference is Mark Jackson's wife is a singer, and I don't know if Cleveland's the right place for them to go, but... But this is the thing. Dan Gilbert has shown that he's willing to spend his money. Uh, the Clippers? last time Singer showed up in Cleveland, it didn't work out well for the uh, presidential candidate. Well, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame is there. Yeah. But, uh, Clippers? The- are the Clippers looking for a coach? Mark still? Jackson played for the Clippers. Yeah. Now, if Mark Jackson is going to a team, so so um, a lot of sports media, the media outlets are reporting that um, the Canelo and the Triple G match yep. might, might continue, to gentlemen. What should what should take on that? Oh, triple, and the fact that Triple G is not even going to make the actual same amount of money as uh, Canelo. Triple G got cheated. You know, I said what? He got, Triple G won that fight. Triple G won the fight. Well, Triple G did win the fight. Yeah, but no, he did, it was kind of has a draw. Yeah, uh, for, okay. But, he, but everybody looked at that fight. Fu- every oh, that fight. stop it! Canelo won that fight. Canelo did not win that fight. Look, well, at like six, look at round six, seven, and eight. Look at round six, seven, and eight. Canelo. Out of oh, he for God's sake! He hit more power punches than than Triple G had the whole night. Triple G had the had the jab work in the whole night. I give him all the credit in the world. Canelo but Canelo put more of a beating on him in the middle rounds. Oh, jeez, I'm done. All, you know the, the NBA draft was held in Barclays in 2013, 2014. <laughs> It's a popular no place care. to do. Ev- <laughs> yeah, it's a That's popular place to do everything though, except win, so except that. watching hockey too. Yeah. <laughs> I just went back to 2013 because I had to. Because I want to see now that we have a real body of work of these guys. Yeah, yeah. 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 So number one overall, another Canadian, Anthony Bennett. Anthony Bennett no. was supposed no. to be. No. That was the worst. Former yep. Net. Or Kwame Net. Brown. That says a lot. You know what? All these guys wind up with the Nets to the Knicks. And they're like, look at former first round pick. Yeah. yeah. Number two. Michael Beasley. So, so Anthony, number two. Victor Oladipo. Oladipo. Oladipo, right? Victor Oladipo. So he turned no- into a superstar this year. Yeah, so that's he's number two. Drafted in 2013. So that's, that's crazy. How many Five years, years right? now. It took him yeah. a long time to come along, but uh, he, is he still with the Magic? The, no, he's with uh, he's with the Pacers. He's with the Pacers. So, yeah, well, he was Does with it the become Thunder, a system though. thing? Yeah, it was be... with the Thunder for yeah, a little bit. He so, got traded to the Thunder with the whole uh, 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 Paul George. By the George. Yeah. No, number three, another great name, Otto Porter. Otto Porter's a, still Otto playing. Porter Jr. He puts it down a little bit. Listen, listen. Third round, third that's overall pick, that, 2013. That's going to be a bust because they wanted to get. They gave him his contract. Is he on the page? Well, he's a shooter. No, no, no. Oh, he's got to be a shooter. shooter. He was supposed to help out Bradley Beal and Jordan sorry, no. get over the hump. He's on he a wizard. Not up, and they gave him 90 million. He's a mid range guy. That's all he needs he's to be. Mid range guy. He can. He can. He add, thinks listen. he's a three point. He's horrible. Num- number four, Cody Zeller. Cody oh. Zeller. Was he the big white guy? Yeah, yeah, big doofy yeah. white guy. There's three yeah. of them. There's uh, Cody. Yeah, there's the brother. Uh, yeah. what, what brother played for Notre Dame, if I remember correctly? Kyle. No, so. not Kyle. Cody. Number five. And Tyler oh, Zeller. Tyler number Zeller. Number five overall. Alex Len. Still playing. For me. Uh, was he play for the Rockets now? Alex Len? No, so all these guys are not with their... It still says he plays for the Phoenix Suns. Oh, it's the Suns. I knew yeah. it was a Southern team. Number okay. six, Nerlens Noel. Ooh. Oh, man, what They're a bust. They're saying that he might go... That's not a bust. They're saying that he might go... Go to, to Golden State. State. No, that go dude... Cleveland. Oh, He's Cleveland, Cleveland. Cleveland. Wow. He might be going to Cleveland I, and to replace uh, Tristan Thompson. That dude can't stay healthy ever. Number, that guy's knees are going to break. Number seven, Ben McLemore. <laughs> Yes, group. doesn't he still play? Play for the Kings, I think. Yeah, we're asking the question, doesn't he still play? This is the sixth overall pick. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> number seven. Uh, no, I'm sorry, Ben, ben McMore, seven or seven. Number eight, Contavious Caldwell Pope. Good yeah. shooter. Very, very polished three-point shooter. Number nine, Trey Burke. <laughs> Trey Burke uh, plays for the Knicks. Plays and for the Knicks. We have him. No, 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 
no, no, no. Listen, Trey Burke, he, he's a he's a good player. He's a good player. I'm not saying he's an all star, but he's a good player. Uh, for ten, a, a, a four year senior out trade of him. Lehigh, <laughs> CJ McCollum. Um, yeah, he's a point guard. He's a backup yeah. for the Indianapolis no, no, pa- uh, Pacers, no, right? No, no, he plays no. for the Trailblazers. Oh, he's a Trailblazer? Oh, yeah, with uh, with what's his name? Uh, with Lillard. It's yeah. CJ.